Hello everyone and welcome to another multi-MC tutorial. As many of you are aware, recently Feed the Beast, FTB, and Twitch parted ways. Uh, Feed the Beast has come out with their own modded Minecraft launcher. It's part of the Overwolf uh, family now. And, uh, and if you want to install FTB mod packs, you can go that route. You can install the FTB launcher and you can install FTB packs via that launcher. If you're like me, however, and you like to have all of your Minecraft instances in one place, and you are a very devoted user to multi-MC, you were kind of left out in the cold, but not really. Um, if you wanted to install an FTB pack, uh, you would go to Add Instance, but over here all you would find is FTB Legacy. And if you selected the FTB Legacy, you would see that there's not many new, there's no new packs in here whatsoever. This is that, this is 1.12, this is 1.12, this is 1.12, etc. right? But all the new packs are for 1.16, uh, 115, and so forth. And how do you go about installing those in multi-MC? Well, there's a special development option that you can select. And under the development option, you can, you have access to all of the new FTB packs. To activate that, to make it so that that setting is available, what you will do is from your multi-MC window, you will go to settings, and then under settings, you'll find your features tab. Under the features tab, you'll find stable. You wanna select that and you wanna to go to development. So when you go to development, what you'll do is you'll close that and then you'll exit out of multi-MC. Once you've closed it, then you'll go back and you'll relaunch MultiMC again. And the first thing that you'll be hit with is an update. So we'll update now. And now MultiMC has restarted. But if we go to add instance again, now we have many more options. We actually have options for Twitch. We have options for, uh, for Technic. And we also have FTB Legacy, but then FTB. And if you look in here, you have all of the new packs. So you've got your Direwolf 20 pack, you've got FTB Revelations, and you have access to all of the older packs as well. So if you're like me and you like to use MultiMC and you wanna make sure that you can stay on the cutting edge of modded Minecraft, that's the way that you would go about doing it. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Hope it was helpful to you. My name is RB Plays, and we'll catch you in the next video.